bacon burger? Oh, Ko got sponsored? Surely he was gonna play it anyway? Oh yeah, dude. I I had tons of hours in the last beta. Yep. I was thrilled when they when they announced that I was gonna be sponsored for this. Mm. Sorry, dear. I need your hides. Okay, I think that's all the hide we need to make our pants, but of course we need to make like all of our armor. God only knows how much we're gonna need. Oh. Okay, all this has been searched already. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Mr. Shilka, I appreciate it. Hit escape and go to events. That's where the medals are for. Hey, Dan! I know, right? It's it's beautiful. It's beautiful. Oh, this is where we spend... Okay, this is... Oh, it's login rewards. Cool. That's what it was. Okay. And then these are used here to claim this entire fashion set. Which we apparently will get on the release of the game, which is kind of fun. Available on the 17th of April. Okay. Cool. Great. And how you doing to play how you doing today, Dan? Are you doing uh are you doing this too, Dan? You playing you doing some once human? How do I go to my warband? There we go. Oh, nope, that was in the world. How do I talk in Warband? Oh, here. Great. Inventory, then butterfly icon. You probably have other deviants. No, I don't. <laughs> yeah, I haven't caught one yet. I can't figure out how to get a beta invite. Uh, go to, click, click the link in my pro, or on the, the top of the chat, once you plan, that'll take you to the Steam page, uh, find the Discord from there, go to the Discord and fill out the survey, and they're giving away 10,000 keys a day to people that fill out the survey. Hopefully you'll get one of those. Here, let's go ahead and do the rift anchor first. And then we'll start doing the, uh, we need weapon and gear crates and mysterious treasure here, so. Oh, we're not even at the location yet. We got a uh, ways to go. But there's just too much stuff to shoot and do around here, dang it. I'm going to this motel. I'm sorry, I gotta go in the motel. This is happening. different what are you you don't look familiar at all huh that is not a common enemy model What's the multiplayer part of this game? It is an online co-op and PvP looter shooter. So it uh, basically it's 
It's one of those games that kind of straddles online multiplayer and MMO. So small server, uh, you know, you run around, you're going to see a few enemies here and there kind of thing. Uh, a few other players here and there. You're not going to see hundreds of players everywhere. It's, it's definitely smaller server stuff. But you build next to other players. You play next to other players. Um, you can, of course, group and join your friends and play together. That kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. But it's not like a traditional MMO. It's one of the kind of newer pseudo MMOs. Pseudo MO. <laughs> pseudo MO. crystal on his butt let's get it nice great okay there should be a chest there it is beauteous hmm another akm interesting bunch of rounds too hell yeah um, okay so first we'll start Bye. What is that? I don't know who you are. I don't trust you. I can explode. Now we get. Okay, we are officially here. progress insufficient oh it can't come back out until it's at 100 oh okay I just want to say nice shorts, bro. Thanks, dog. Appreciate you. They are nice shorts. Okay. Oh. I really like that everyone gets their own loot. So you never have to worry about like running through or, or beating other players or anything like that. Feels good, man. Didn't the chest used to be down here? You had to like get a fuse and stuff. Oh yeah, maybe, maybe someone already do that. Maybe. So this didn't give us the chest we need, unfortunately. I think that's still somewhere in this area. How can we get into this building? Oh, are we in it? Oh, this is it. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I just walk in the front door and get it now, huh? Okay. 
I feel like they made this game a lot easier, at least at the beginning. I remember having a much more difficult time than I'm having now. That may not be the worst thing, though. I remember people complaining about the game being kind of... more difficult than it should be at the beginning. So maybe, maybe this is based on feedback around that. Alright, now we just gotta find this rift anchor and activate it, which should be right in front of us, actually. If only there was some kind of giant purple... Oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Great! Beautiful. Alright, meet Mary under the monolith of... Let's go. Oh, wait. We have enough for our pants now. Let's go make some pants. Hell yeah. Okay, my stuff here is done. Awesome. Uh, let's first look over here. Let's do this first. Nada. Boom. Beautiful. Lots of great parts there. There it is. Cortex level one. Process it on a synthesis bench to get level two ectopic gray matter. You know, as you do. Um, Okay, so I've got the four bonus of the rustic, and then I now I have the two bonus of the raid. All right, we'll make that work. Great. Need some better looking boots, though. We'll figure that out. We got a lot of journey stuff to get. Gotta craft some fish bait. Gotta catch a fish, chat. Okay. Great. What's my weight right now? 24. Let's eat this before it goes. No, don't, don't take that. Hold on. Is there an all for inventory? Is there not an everything? There needs to be an everything. Oh yeah, dude. They really need to add an everything. Okay. Hey, 0110 with the 47. Thank you, bud. Okay. Uh, Let's see. You're about to be destroyed. How are we looking here? Copper pickaxe. Look at that. Bronze casting. Look at that. Resource detection. Okay. Shotgun. Assault rifle. Intermediate tool.
Need three ciphers for that. Okay. Um, we need to make some water collection stuff here. Great. A lot of good stuff, though. need some logs. Great. Oh, I cannot wait to do another big build in this game. Woo! How long is the beta for? Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure when the beta ends. Uh, okay. We're just going to drop this here. Just so we have some water. Don't even need to connect a pipe or anything. Yeah, that'll at least hold some water in there. Uh, do we have a stove yet? Mm. Oh, look, it started raining to fill up my thing. Thank you so much. Well, apparently this game is a filthy liar. That's cool. That's fine. I'm a liar myself. It, it works. We build a stove. Stove. Great. Boiled water. That's what we're looking for right there. Awesome. So we're going to need some more wood for this. I really need some sort of chocobos on the Kovatars. Like a chocobo mask? I think we could talk to Julia. Maybe add that to our next update. Do I have a character in Dave the Diver? I do. I do have a character in Dave the Diver. My name is Ko. I'm a server. And I'm actually pretty freaking good. Yeah. Oh, look at this. Interesting. Time required. That's new. I don't, I don't know what that means. Normally when it would rain, it would just like start ticking up. Huh. They nerfed the heck out of water collectors. You're better off doing it yourself at a water's edge. Oh yeah? Did they? Grab all this while we're here. Because why not? I don't even know what this house is. Damn. Dude, there's so much stuff in here. It's been a freaking gold mine. Okay. Great. All right, let's keep moving. Is this game any good? Oh, yeah, absolutely. I'm not big on PvP games. Oh, you don't need to play PvP in this game at all if you don't want to. PvP is 100% optional. We need the hides off these guys pretty badly. Mm -mm -mm -mm. 
All right, let's move up. Hi, how are you? Meet Mary. Nice work with the rift anchors. I guess you're the real deal after all. I am the real deal. The festering gel was packing serious firepower. Sounds tough. But I think it was worth it. Each time a rift anchor was activated, there was an obvious reaction inside the monolith. The deviation must be holed up inside. Okay, that sounds good. Uh, one second shot. So what's the plan now? Let's go in together this time. I'm curious about that troublemaker inside. And besides, we're a team. I brought some ammo and meds for us as well. Now let's go. Oh, thanks. Oh, wow, you just gave me so much stuff. My girl. All right, let's go. I need some gravel. We can get in the sulfur, actually. Oh, I learned a copper pickaxe, and then I didn't make one. Derp, 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 derp. I'll just add myself to the uh, the chain here. I love it, dude. Nice. I love seeing all these other players' camps. That's really, really cool. I feel like this game is begging for a system where a player can make a public camp that other players can walk up to and like hit F on and then join that public camp and have that count as their camp. So like one person could drop a social camp and then like tons of players could all like join together in that camp. Because I have to admit, this is cool, but it, it looks pretty dumb. <laughs> it, it looks pretty dumb having the exact same camp spawned like a hundred times in a small area. I feel like there's 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 a there's a more elegant solution to this. Oh, here's one. What if there was some system so if enough camps were put near each other, they somehow amalgamated into like a higher tier camp? And then like people could keep adding more camps around it, and if like so, like, if 10 small camps got put together, they would become a group camp. And then if 10 more small camps got put out, it would then amalgamate into the next tier. And then, like, it would be, like, the more people that put camps down, like, the larger the community camp would get that everyone could use. It'd be kind of hard to do, but I can think of some ways they could do that that'd be really fun. And that'd be a very cool kind of, like, a way to have a social mechanic for solo players. I mean, I'd, I'd love a mechanic like that as a solo player. So, huh, something to think about. Something to think about. Sir Lucas, you have quite the peach, my friend. All right, let's go. Well done, Sir Lucas, well done. Oh, hi. Oh, wait, there's like no reason to get anything here? I guess we're just going right in, huh? Okay. Whoa. I really would like a good shotgun. I don't have a good shotgun. I just have a relatively bobo shotgun. I want a good shotty. Maybe one of them big boys. Mm. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, let's stick to main story, he says, as he continues to run around and not do main story. Even the devs were like, hey, we loved your sponsored stream yesterday, but maybe you could, like, focus a little more on the main story to show that cool stuff. And I was like, I'll try, dude. I'll try. It's not part of me. It's not in my blood. I'm trying, man. All right, main story. Let's go. Mm -hmm. There's so much loot in the game, though. I know! It's everywhere! It's a looter's dream. One of the reasons I love this game. There's not only loot everywhere, but, like, everything is useful. Even the basic materials you get can be, like, are usable in endgame things. It's also awesome. it's very cool. Can we trade with other players in this game? Let me see. What? What is that? What is requests? Wait, that's Mary. I wasn't even the... I don't want you to leave. There's our waypoint. That's good. Am I out? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, shoot. I am out of AK ammo. That's a bummer. Boom. Oh. All right, let's go get that tower, and then we're just going to go right to the main main quest area. Did I hear Yakuza tonight? Uh, probably. Probably. Maybe. Hopefully. There's gonna be something. We may start with a rerun and uh, of the morning stream, like we're doing now in the evenings. And then when I have time, I may jump on for like an hour or two. The vending machines are unlockable crafted items you can place in your territory. Cool. The finals is the most fun I've had in a shooter ever. Dude, I had a great time with the finals. Me and uh, me and my buddy Barry Carline, uh, the, the lead coder here in the channel, we, we played a lot of that game. Good time. There's some other final type games coming out in the next little bit that I'm looking forward to trying. Some of them are doing some fun new things with kind of the main loop, which I think could be pretty cool. Finals was fun, but like it was a little too, uh, it got a little too basic for me. There just wasn't there wasn't enough kind of variation in the the main loop to keep the shooty shooty interesting for me. But I mean, I did get what? I mean, me and Barry played for like these twenty hours. I mean, we got free to play game and it was fun. Yeah. Good game and not a lot of depth. Exactly, Maki. That's like it was good enough for us to play every night for like a couple weeks, but then it just you know it just got a little 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 boring. Not not enough variation, not enough interesting stuff every round. It became very samey. I noticed we were we were just playing like the same rounds over and over. And granted, there were a couple of the game modes, but there may be powerful rift and still a good game. If you've never played it, I definitely recommend checking it out. Uh, there may be powerful rift entities lurking inside the monolith. Step into the rift to catch a glimpse of the entity's true form. Locate the rift entrance inside a monolith and interact with it to challenge a rift entity. It is recommended to team up first. Hmm. All right. What's this game about? Well, I would say that, I would say go watch my thoughts video, but to be honest, don't. Because so much has changed in this beta that I clearly am gonna need to make a new one. Um, but the TLDR of this game is it's a co-op multiplayer looter shooter with PVP elements, base building elements, um, lots of progressive elements, a lot of RPG elements that we don't normally see in looter shooters. Like there's, there's a lot more kind of defined 
world progression and like you you actually move through levels in like a like an rpg world so like this region is like the you know level seven area and then you have like the level it's 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 almost borderlandsy in how you move through it which is really cool um and it really works also sir lucas uh does add a lot to this thank you sir lucas and uh yeah it's been it's been really enjoyable i played the last beta a whole bunch and i'm back this beta to check it out and it's been really good really good